Lola, hey, you promised you wouldn't interfere. No, Ruben, we promised that we wouldn't interfere. Uh -huh. You've already galloped across that Rubicon. Uh, there is too much. Hey, Zach, where the fuck? Oh, wait, who the fuck? Hey, hey, not now, Jimmy. No, we fucking agreed. The whole group gets to say on newcomers. Don't hey. worry, Mr. Um... Montana. Do you mean Montana? Yeah, you probably see me on TV. Fabulous. Mr. Montana. Well, I was just about to leave anyway. But I must just drop in on Tisha before I go. You can't see her. Oh, Ruben. Yeah, well, no one gets to see her. What? She ain't here. What do you mean? Well, she went out looking for food with a little gang of hers. They're overdue. I always told you, Ruben, the tighter the leash, the harder they pull. Get out! I'll see you down the line. Later, Jimmy. Why'd you let her go? Hey, she ain't my kid. Oh, if I was in Jimmy. charge... Listen. You yeah, fucking whatever! Teacher, all right? Look, Rubes, there's something in me. Oh, please! We need... No. I need her back safe, all right? Now, look. It's gonna take time to analyze your blood to, to, to get answers, all right? Now, Tisha... Tisha doesn't have time, all right? Tisha doesn't have time. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Thanks. Thanks. What Tisha said to me, growing up, Ruben never let her out of his sight. Does that sound natural to you? <laughs> She's sure as hell out of his sight now. Hello, Denise. Tisha's missing. Any clues? Her crew were joking about hitting the bean cup with some Tisha and Tom. Bean cup. Lovely. Thanks. Find this bean cup cafe and start there, I guess.
cool place, people. Funky living in the age of the Zompocalypse. Guess it's a not-so-secret hideout now. <laughs> Just don't tell the others we're here. Hey, and don't eat all the snacks. This whole thing is shady as fuck. I'm telling you, someone in the CDC is still managing to move data around. How can you tell? I've had nothing else to do for days. Trust me, there are people getting around this blackout. Maybe even using it to their advantage. But how? Why? Yeah, that's the part I'm not so sure on. Ruben's gotta be involved if it's the CDC. He's the shadiest fucker of all. Old Rubes is freaking out. Must be, to send his VIP. Firstly, I volunteered and no one sent me. Secondly, I'm not sure I trust him. Why'd you say that? Dunno. A tingle in my socks. <laughs> yeah, join the club. So, get this. I'm sightseeing in Brentwood sewers when this lady, bare feet, calm as you like, tries to kill me. Not five minutes ago, I walk in on her and your dad, chatting like an old couple. Auntie Lola? Why would she be here? That's her. She acts like this is all just another day at the office. Mm, that's pretty crazy, even for her. She knows more than she's saying. But first, come back and let Rubes know you're okay. <laughs> Not happening. This is your family, Tisha. Okay. God, hold up. Look, we both want to know what's going on with Dad, right? If I give you a direct line to Lola, can you give me more time to investigate? Dunno. I don't want to piss off the one guy that can get me out of here. Look, there's a data blackout, right? No internet, no nothing. But our resident hacker, Ava, has found data packets routing between the Serling, CDC HQ, and the Randgate building. It might clue us up on what Dad's mixed up in. And what is this hotline to your Auntie Lola? I got a code phrase. <sighs> Look, you go to an OSK store and say 12 Sambuca Karaoke Queens to the OS. OSK? Wait, she's that Lola Conrad? Yeah, and if she's involved, it's something wild. Okay, deal. But we share the goss, right? No more being kept in the dark. Yeah, I was gonna say the same thing. Cool. Welcome to the Mushroom Club.
So, Lola Conrad, OSK billionaire recluse, did not flee LA. Instead, she tracked me down and awakened something inside of me. My socks are definitely tingling. Here we are, OSK store. Right, find the scope and mutter the magic phrase. Bollocks. Server reboot needed. And I'm as tech-savvy as a wooden spoon.
Okay, you stink even worse than before. I didn't realize how much I needed to sit down. You and the mom get tired of each other already? Well, my tummy's no fuller, but I thought, fuck it. If I'm gonna starve to death, I'm not gonna do it with a mop in my hands. Better drink up then. Hands free of mopping are free for drinking. Amongst other things. So, who's better company? Me or the mom? Ooh, tough one. Pop? She already cleaned me out. Too late. Too, too late. I know what you are. I know what you are. That makes one of us. Name's Jacob. Heard you need some help. Help? That's what she... You're here to steal just like her. Huh. Next thing you'll say is that I can trust you too. Trust no one. Who stole from you? Denise! She came in when I wasn't here. Without my permission. And she stole the bag that was right underneath my bed, and, and she can't do that! That's wrong! Hey, calm your wobble. I'll help. What's your name? Luther. Cool name. Look, I'll have a chat with Denise. Sort this out, yeah? No, she wants that! She wants you to talk, then she'll steal your teeth. And you won't even get a nickel. I'm not like her. My buddy Byron, he'll see you right. Jolly good. You stay put. Byron! Byron! Byron, come on, man! This isn't funny! No, 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 I didn't. I, I didn't lose him. I didn't. <laughs> 